Hey, Mum. You know that, that, that really nice souffle that you always do? Yes, that one. You got the recipe for that, right? Do you think I could have that? Just, just ring when, you, when you've got the recipe, okay? See you later. Yeah, bye. Okay, guys, up. I want you guys gone by the time I get back. <laughs> so, uh, tell me about this, um, Mr. Treater of yours. Mr. Treater, yes. Is he? Is he, uh, is he your like boyfriend? A boyfriend or something? Oh no, he's not my boyfriend. Oh, really? Oh, really? Well, what is he to you then? He's just a good friend. Yeah. Mom. Hello. Here we are. There's your recipe. Yeah, he's just a really good friend. <laughs> he makes me laugh. Um, tell me about this. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, what? He, he didn't wear clothes, really. What? How is this? What? Oh. Ah! oh, goodness me, what on earth is all this fuss for? Wanted to make a souffle. Who is coming for dinner anyway? Just a friend. A friend? A male friend? Or a female friend? A female friend? Well, how exciting. And where did you meet her? On the internet. She could be a serial killer for all we know. So could I. I really don't know why you've gone to all this trouble, Michael. I mean, is it really worth it? If you try to give her all her favourite things so early on in the relationship, she'll lose interest, won't she? There'll be nothing left. What, what can she be interested in after that? No, it's a shame. Well, personally, I would have chosen a Sunday roast. But if you've got to cook a souffle, thank goodness you've got a good old mum who can come and save the day for you. So... Oh no! What's happened to the souffle? It's all right, Mum. Nobody's perfect. You tried your best. Come on. Guys, look after Mum for me. What? Where's she going? Hang on.